welcome to the Royalty Project. So this is the beginning of our journey on the way to being crowned king or queen at the end of the cycle. The place to be, uh, our vibe tribe or our tribe vibe and they are in the shape of a trophy because when we do these things this is how we all win my royal you to unmute and begin to call out the words that you see in this space powerful that was very powerful that is the practice of affirming how we want to be in this space black culture is the pulse of american culture what was your favorite session session one which was culture i think i liked the culture session what i liked about it was like learning more things about culture culture is my favorite. The culture one. I like how we introduced ourselves and mm -hmm. how welcoming it, it felt. We have in the chat, I found yeah. a lot of fellow musicians. We need to get together or something. Look at that. I love that. Building community. There was okay. a beautiful moment where the youth spoke about names and how that's very unique to mm. being Black and names having meanings. And Naima and Shoma shared uh, what their names meant. Chioma, what does your name mean? My name, um, it means God is good. Um, my, my name was represented from a jazz song. That's dope. There's power Amazing. in what you're called and beauty in your names as well. You can call me Olu. We're not just young youth, we're young leaders who have the ability and the voice to give back to the community. You are absolutely right. Thank you for pointing that out, Olu. I just had an epiphany. Uh oh. oh. Oh, oh, yeah, girl. Girl. What we revealed was Black people make amazing contributions to America and American history. All right. That's, That's absolutely right. perfect. Yeah. My favorite one was the Missing History. Missing History? My favorite session was most definitely Missing History because I felt like it was the one I was able to contribute to the most. Africa is a very large country. Fact or cap? Africa is a continent, not a country. Gain your bag, Garvey. Are we ready to jump into the next one? Yes. Let's go. Let's get it. Africa and its countries are among the poorest places in the world. Cap. 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 Africa isn't poor. One of the richest continents. There's a lot of gold mines and a lot of resources down in Africa. Our world youth are really dropping some beautiful uh, gems here. Let them know that we My favorite session was wealth. The one with wealth. I think I feel like that's going to help me in life to, you know, like a way to how I can spend my money and make the most of it. Well, I like saving money and learning about money. Mine was wealth because it was teaching us how to save money and the activity was fun. When we distributed our money. The one where we talked about how to spend your money because it taught me how to manage money. So now that when I get older, I can I can know how to manage money. We should start saving now. It's really good that I finally figured this out because when you ask your parents something, you're expecting them to get it for you or when they say we need it for something else. Now it feels different and I actually know what they mean. Marina, that's great. That sounds like a benediction. No debation. Fact. I think I like melanin because uh, we could, we danced and all of that. It is my favorite part. The real movement begins now. Melanin is um, our superpowers and it makes us who we are. I connected to the dancing session because um, I really like the dancing as a way to express myself. What's your, what was your favorite movement? Can I see which part of the dance? Come on. Naima, go Naima, go Naima, go Naima. Go Naima. Hey, hey, I'm beautiful. I'm beautiful. I'm limitless and what's the last one Naima? I love my crown. All these sessions, have they made you feel powerful kind of within your Blackness? Yeah. I love that knowing that we have. I love that the knowing that you as royal you have. Like, I know. I feel this. I know my ancestors sacrificed for me to be me.
No one's going to tell me who I am or who I'm supposed to be. I help a lot of people around me. I am proud of me. I am unique. I am a survivor. I am enough. I am special. I am blessed. I am amazing. And I love myself. I am great. I am wonderful. I'll be successful. I am loved. I am beautiful. I am talented. I am fearless. I am smart. I am capable. I am empowered. I am unique and set apart. My skin color is one of the amazing gifts my people bring to the world. I am capable of so much because my ancestors said so. I'm stunned into silence at the amazing of <laughs> all you. What does it mean to be black? Black is unique. So just be yourself and you're black. Being powerful. I think black means to be like free. To like know who you are and be informed in your history and your history. It means to be unique. Well, I feel like to be Black, it means that you can represent yourself and not be scared about what anyone else thinks. All Black people are strong. A lot of Black people can do things that no, most people can't. It gives me flavor. It gives me personality. Welcome back, folks. Let's make room for other folks to come in here. Yes. Yes, Fiona's ready. Fiona's ready. So who gets to define you? Only me. Hey, that's what Perfect. I'm talking about. How would you describe the Royalty Project? Great way to learn about Black culture. I have a moment where they made you feel good from one of the sessions, like, no, nah, I like this. Like a moment of joy. I don't really have a specific moment, but mm -hmm. like most of the time, I was having a really good time and enjoying and like laughing. I would describe the Royalty Project as fun. It could be for kids and adults who want to learn more about being black and the importance of it. I think the Royalty Project is a very knowledgeable but also comfortable space for people like me to be in because not only do we get to learn, but we also get to connect with others that are just like us. It's fun and teaches. It's an organization that um, helps inform uh, young black kids about like their missing history. It was like an impactful creating of a community. How, how would you describe the world's impression? It, it was very good. I learned a lot and I really liked um, the time that we put together to um, actually learn about things that they didn't teach us in school. It's fun and it teaches you a lot of life lessons. I would describe it as a project that shows the true history of black people. If I had to give it a title, the title would be True History of Black People. I would describe it as it's very interesting. Like you can learn many things. How'd you like the trip? The trip, I loved it. <laughs> um, it was cold, but I still loved it. I love the way how we got to find clues and how we just got to meet each other in person. And with that, can we play our song? Saluting kings and queens in the place to be. Let know that we're royalty. Saluting kings and queens in the place to be. Let them know that we're royalty. Cause all we got is that straight loyalty. We let